right, welcome back to the Knives Fast channel, guys. Down there are Ren and Stimpy and Powder Toast Man and Log and TV, so say hello. Uh, but we're out on the deck. It's a hot day, so I figured why not bake my brains out and do an unboxing. I just came back from the mailbox, um, and I got a couple of packages. So it's funny, I've been remarking that it's been really slow lately, but that was good because I had Blade Show and a vacation and then a knife to launch. Uh, by the way, if you haven't gotten in on the Pinion pre-order, check it out, TempestKnives.com. Uh, got a little ways to go here, but we're making really good progress. So if you're interested in a great value knife, check it out, TempestKnives.com. But anyway, so uh, I looked the other day at some of the pass-around groups, and I'm like, holy moly, I'm signed up for a lot of stuff. But that's good, because I, I uh, as of tomorrow, let's see. No, I've got four more knives waiting to be reviewed. I just reviewed two yesterday and two today. And I'm going to send a package back to somebody and then probably review two more tomorrow and send that package back. Um, and then I'll be down to two pass around knives and then I got more and there's more and more and more coming in. So whoo, time to get ready to roll. So let's see. We got two packages here. This first one's got a really lovely color to it. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, this one comes... Uh, by way of one of the pass around groups, and we're going to find out momentarily which one because I'm not sure. It's either the lefty pass around group or the uh, apex pass around group. But this comes from Lewis over at Addicted to Knives. And guys, if you're not following Lewis, uh, check him out. He is pretty cool, dude. So this is uh, actually from the lefty pass around group, as we're going to call it. Uh, Kevin has just somehow made enough contacts with enough knife people that they're just going to send him knives left and right. And that's cool. And Kevin is such a cool dude that he is going to share it uh, with a group of us. And as you can see, we have an Oaks Works knife. There's some stickers, so I'm going to take one of those. Ooh, I just got a, a pinion sale. It just popped up right there. Holy moly, that's a good one too. Uh, thank you, whoever you were, right in the middle of my recording, which I will take... All of you do it real quick. Uh, so this is an Oaks Works knife, and I think this is going to be the Solar Storm. It is. I am very excited to check this one out. Now, you guys know I got to check out the um, Osprey from Andrew Hobbard, and now this is the Solar Storm. Uh, ooh, I actually, I thought it was going to be a little small, but this is actually a decent size, and I got a choke up. And a wicked hollow grind. Look at that. Um, yeah, this is this is pretty sweet. So I love this uh, this kind of harpoon here. Let's see how the action is. I bet it's going to be pretty. Oh yeah. And it is a flipper only, but I know some guys have been flip flicking it from the. Uh, well, not this one. I don't think. Let's see. Nope. No happening for me. Uh, but man, it. Feels great. This one, Eric Oaks designed some gorgeous knives, 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 and this is, uh, yeah. So this is really nice. Uh, that is the Oaks Works Solar Storm. So there it is from this side, and here it is from this side, and here's the closed profile. And it looks like we got a brown micarta inlay. Very nice, and a wickedly uh, milled pocket clip. I like that. All right, now we're gonna use, I, I used the Miguron Valona to open that one, but now that we got the Solar Storm out, we'll use the Solar Storm for the next one. Now this one comes uh, from a new guy at, to, to one of the pass around groups, and I believe this is gonna be from the Apex pass around group. This is from Nocturne Knives. Uh, if you're not familiar with him, check him out. If I think about it, I'll try to have a, a link to both him and Lewis down below. But you know me, I'll probably forget. Uh, I cannot remember to which knife this is, but I'm pretty sure this is from the Apex. Here we go. There's a Nocturne uh, Knives and uh, a sticker, it looks like. Yeah, so that's very cool. Or a card, I can't tell. Um, I think it's a sticker. All right, I'm running out of room over here on the shelf. So, oh, I know what this is. I should have had... A penguin with me they're downstairs I usually do unboxings downstairs so but this is gonna make me very happy 
you guys know that I like large knives. And you know I like the penguin. As a matter of fact, there is a, a jig titanium penguin coming out of traditional pocket knives. Uh, my video hit for that today when I'm recording this um, at the, on Monday the 18th. But um, oh, 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 this is the Penguin XL. Now, I did get to hold this at Blade Show, but not for long. Um, and this is in this ridiculous purple titanium. Uh, this is beautiful. And look, guys, a wire clip. Um, yeah, so much yeah. Uh, so let's see what we got here with a bigger blade. Oh, yeah. Oh, now, wait a minute. I forgot that it has a flipper tab. It's got a flipper tab and a thumb stud. So guess what, guys? Uh, I'm not going to run downstairs right now and get the other penguins, but in my review, you will have comparisons with my titanium penguin and my jig titanium penguin. Uh, and you, good golly, that is great size. I like that. Very, very nice. Uh, so again, here is the open profile, both... Uh, like this, and like such. And we'll give you the closed profile with that beautiful wire clip and that. I wonder, guys, uh, I might have been with the Mach 51, one of the first ones to, to do a wire clip with QSP, and maybe I got them thinking. No, I'm just not taking that credit. I'm just being obnoxious. So, uh... Really cool. So here's the Solar Storm EDX. Let's do them this way. Solar Storm EDX and the XL Penguin. Uh, these will go into the review rotation and in my pocket. Um, yeah, very excited uh, to check these out. And thanks, Nocturne Knives. Thanks, QSP and David over at the Apex Pass Around Group, who is QSP USA. Uh, thanks, Oaksworks. And thanks, Kevin. Um, yeah, and thanks, Lewis, for sending that along. So really, really cool guys. Two really phenomenal knives. Uh, looking forward to checking them out. So hope you enjoyed being out here with my dogwood tree uh, and the, the freshly mowed, barely can see grass and the weeds. So um, there you go. Thank, thank you so much, guys, for, for all your support. If you're not subscribed, go down and click that subscribe button and the... Um, notification bell and give me a thumbs up and a comment and thank you ever so much for watching the knives fast channel